Key and Peele, it seems to me, is like the result of looking at SNL, looking at Mad TV and going, we could be doing so much more and, and we could approach this differently that, that I would have just assumed that you were plotting and planning the whole time. Kudos to Jordan. It was Jordan who was plotting and planning the whole Interesting. time. Interesting, okay. Jordan, I know, felt fettered at Mad TV. Jordan was becoming, no one was, pay, not enough people were paying attention. There were some people paying attention, but not enough people were paying attention that the greatest sketch writer of the 21st century was building his chops on that television show. And we had talked about working together and we'd done a couple things in between. I was on the sitcom, he had done a, um, he had done a, a, a pilot for Fox that didn't go. So my sitcom got canceled and his pilot for Fox didn't go. And our manager said, would you guys be interested in doing something together? Because I've got a situation that I think I can leverage. And we did. And then he and I used to meet and we would, we would perform sketches to the point, on the table read days, to the point where all the writers and some of the producers would get super excited to see us perform our sketch. Does that come from an improv background too? Absolutely. Standing and interacting with each other, always better than reading it on the page. Always, 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 always. So when you guys got the opportunity to, to write your own sketches for Key and Peele, how much space would you leave for that very kind of thing? In the beginning, in the first season, we didn't leave much space. We didn't improvise a lot in the first season. You didn't. Jordan said, I want finally to be, get, now that I've been given the opportunity, I want you and me to sit here and write bulletproof sketches so that we get lauded for r good writing. And so he I was is like, a planner. Oh, he's a planner. He's, he's a, a chess plotter. player, a plotter, a chess player, a stra all in a, I'm not, not pejorative, in a good way. Yeah. He was the one saying, let's make it bulletproof. Then we sat down. He, I sat down with him one day and I said, look, buddy, we've got a skill set that I think we could be utilizing more. You and I, I believe we are magic together when we're together and we're improvising. We've got to spend more time having fun. And I would say in the history of Keen Peel, a lot of the scenes that seem to really crackle for people are when Peter has just locked off a couple of cameras, wide here, punch in here, punch in there, action. 